and it's it could possibly keep you from moving on and it's going to confuse you on what direction to take but don't let it spirit is saying do not because this is not the relationship for you let this person go they're going to try to offer you stability Can I get a clarifying cup? There we go. The lovers. See? Look at that. Strength with the lovers, being clarified by the lovers. You have a twin flame love coming in. You do not need this asshole that has been a jerk to you and lying and seven of cups causing you confusion. It's just time to rest and relax and um, heal. And yeah, you have the Knight of Wands clarifying the Knight of Pentacles. So you have somebody that's going to come in and offer you passion and stability. So let this relationship go. And this is not going to resonate with everybody. So please, if you're in a very happy, loving, committed relationship, please don't email me and tell me that this, my message was all wrong and that it, no, this message is for somebody out there. This message is happening or this situation is happening to somebody. So allow them to have their message in peace, please. Okay, your advice. Uh, religious factors. Your love life is being influenced by re religious factors. And stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. I'm going to clarify those two cards with the Tarot of Sexual Magic. Why is this religious factors card here, please? Oh, way too many. <laughs> way too many again. Why is this religious factor? There we go. The Eight of Swords. So for a group of you, um, your twin flame is still married. And that's why religious factors are standing in your way. They are not out of their marriage yet, but they will be. They are leaving their partner and they have the King of Cups clarifying it. They love you. They will be back, but they have to get out of this religious or this marriage. Um, I don't know. Did this one fall out with this one or this one? Either way, you have the Ace of Swords here. Um, the Stars and the Three of Pentacles. Oops, I think those were this. Okay, so stay optimistic about your love life. Positive romance or positive thinking will bring you romance. So this person. Um, they're really putting all their trust. No, you are being required to put all your trust in them. Spirit is saying, take a leap of faith because this is your wish come true. So go ahead and let go. It's here for you. You just have to get out of this karmic relationship. They're also getting out of their karmic relationship. And you guys will be together soon. So that's my message for you guys, Gemini. I hope you enjoyed your messages for the end of February. I'm sorry about the delay. Um, but I hope you guys have a beautiful end of the month, and I will see you again in March. I will also be posting channeled messages from Spirit um, that where I don't pull cards or just direct channeled messages. I hope you join me for that. Um, check out your sun, moon, rising, and Venus. As always, this will not resonate with everybody, so take what you want, leave what you don't, and I will see you guys next time. God bless, and sending you all love and light.